Hey, this is Trixie from TrixieExchange.com showing you a whole bunch of really cool shoes that I have up for sale. These, whoops, sorry. I'm trying to get my camera right. These are on eBay right now. Cleaning out my closet. Got lots of really cool chunky platforms from the 90s. And I also have other stuff other than shoes. I've got furry stuff that I'm going to list soon. Great Burning Man festivals, whatever summer festival you're going to that you need fur for, so let's get started. All right, cool. So most of these are size six, six and a half, because obviously that's my size. And they're chunky platforms. So if you're looking for some retro clubby shoes, I'm really hoping the big flare pants come back into style. Then I've got lots of cool shoes. Okay, I've got a lot of wedges as well. Some, a few of them are size sevens or eights, uh, but most are six and a half. Okay, so let's go through this. I've got some soda platforms, leather and suede, textured bottom, awesome. This is one of my favorite brands, Miro. They're made in Mexico, real leather. You can see their thing on there a little bit. Um, these have really cool textured soles. These are like a Mary Jane style. They're like a burgundy red and they have Velcro closure, which I love because I hate tying shoelaces. Really cool spider webs. Walking in a spider webs, leave a message and I'll call you back. Total no doubt. Sorry, I just had to sing that song. All right. Angela's cracking up over here, my stupid jokes. Okay, chunky, these are like red and pink Aldo shoes with really cool two-tone laces. These are crazy big. So platform sketchers, okay, super platforms. Heavy leather with glitter laces. I think these are size seven. Uh, Voltaire. Mary Jane's platforms with Velcro closure. Again, I'm kind of lazy doing shoelaces. Okay, camera, you need to focus. Sorry. All right. Another mural brand with stars on them, kind of punk rock, chunky Oxford looking shoes. Paprika, orange stripes. They remind me of JLo for some reason. I don't know why. Badgley Mishka. Uh, these are really good wedding shoes and summer shoes. They look really cute on when you put your foot in there and the flower kind of pops out. Very classy. Some Jeffrey Campbell's. These are um, like a very small wedge flat. I love the bows on them. I think they're brand new. Never been worn. No surprise when I have this many shoes. Of course there's going to be shoes I've never worn before in my stash. Okay, let me see if I can get this focused. Sorry about that. Okay, I have a few vintage ones. These are Garolini. They come with dust bags. Brand new. And rhinestones on the back. Via Spiga, patent leather toe, Mary Jane style. Really cute. Those would be great for work too and going out. I love these because these are like pinup style. I feel like I love houndstooth. So they got a peep toe with patent leather trim. Houndstooth platform and a houndstooth heel, Steve Madden's. Another vintage style. I think these are Garolini as well. Bandolini, sorry. Bandolino, totally off. But these are vintage black suede. Um, these are Aldo's and, sorry, this is kind of hard holding this and showing it to you at the same time. All the boots lace up real rabbit fur on the inside. Sorry if you can't really see that very well. These are super warm for winter. Uh, next ones are great for wedding seasons. If you're getting married or you just want to, you know, be that person that's clashing wearing white at a wedding. You know, anyways, I love the wood heel and the peep toes. Naughty Monkey, these remind me of Indian shoes. Wedges, rhinestones all over the place. 
have them in two different colors. Sorry, my camera's not focusing quite as well as I wanted to on some of this. North Face Furry Boots. Really warm, great for winter. I think those are size seven, seven and a half. I always put insoles in my winter boots because I like those Ugg soles, so I buy mine a little bit big. Kinsey Platforms laser cut out flowers on the sides with bows. And the back strap. These are some Italian shoes. Um, not super familiar with the brand. I think it's Massimo Dogana. Um, leather. It's kind of like a blackish navy blue with snakeskin trim. Really classy and uh, cool uh, shiny heel there. Now these I think are great for going out in the club. Like it's a sheer lace. These are BB with buckles and an open toe. You could do really cool like leggings or tights or socks with these and layer them with the lace. I think you could make those really funky. And they're also really sexy without even any of that anyways. Like these are MIA fringe boots. The nice big heel, fringe going down the side, and some chain detailing around the middle. All right, let me show you some of the furry vests. So, these are not up yet, but they will be soon. Oops, sorry, my camera is not focusing. This is a headdress, which I want to say would be great for Burning Man, but I don't want you to moop all over the playa, so maybe you could wear that at a local festival event so people don't yell at you for your feathers dropping. This one is really cool. This is a furry vest with fringe, and then I've got another one underneath that that is like a chevron print vest and then there's a few furry vests over here different colors unisex pretty much one size looks great on girls and guys this one's super fluffy and those will be up soon don't have those up yet but i'm working on it so the shoes should be available at my trixie exchange ebay store and the vests, when they're up, should be on eBay, and I will most likely put those on my website at trixieexchange.com as well. Um, but check me out. This is me. I also make a ton of handmade clothing on my website, trixieexchange.com. And so if you like this video, make sure you press the like button below. Subscribe to my videos. I'm going to have sewing tutorial videos, haul videos videos of me sewing things. I teach sewing classes. So just make sure to check me out. I'm Trixie. See you guys later.